Hey everyone, Amanda here. So this is video number five in the 33 Traits of the Narcissistic Mother series. <clears throat> <coughs> oh, excuse me. <clears throat> okay, so number five. Does your mother only support those things you do that reflect on her as a good mother? Okay, well... I don't know if it's exactly that way, but there are times when, um, like, there are choices that were made um, that weren't, you know, the greatest choices, had negative outcomes. If those situations are brought up, then... There's a lot of defensiveness and deflection and lots of, oh, so I'm just a horrible mother kind of thing. So in that way, I would say yes. But as far as my actions, um, I've never really got that impression in that way of expressing it. But the other way, yes. Um... Yeah, I don't have any, I mean, maybe, I don't know if I never picked up on it, I don't know, but to my knowledge, I don't have any experience of that because she doesn't, I don't know if she thinks of my actions as a reflection on her, but more it's bringing up her actions that could look like she wasn't being a good mother. Um, that being brought up and that having an effect on the way she responds to it. So, yeah. Okay, so I guess she just expresses it in just a different way, I guess. <laughs> okay. Yeah, well, that's a very short one. But, um, yeah, um, I'm sure that other people have their own experiences and, um, you know, have their own stories to tell about that, you know, their, you know, your own personal experience. So I'm sure there's other people that have, um, examples that they could share, um, with you guys. Okay. Well, thank you for watching. I appreciate it. I love you all. Please take care of yourselves and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.